Hi, I'm Yvonne. I'm going to show you how to make your own scented dead sea salts. It only takes a few minutes to make. It makes a great gift, a great product to sell, or a great way to relax in the bath. Dead sea salts are full of minerals that heal the skin, reverse signs of aging, and opens your pores and allows them to breathe. Sending the salts makes your bath even more relaxing and therapeutic. Here's how to do it. Here's what you'll need to get started. One pound of Dead Sea salts, 15 to 24 drops of fragrance or essential oils, one tablespoon of carrier oils. This can be DPG, jojoba oil, shea nut oil, or grapeseed oil. Okay, let's get started. First, pour your Dead Sea salts into a large bowl. Next, add the carrier oil. We're using jojoba oil today because it's very moisturizing for the skin and a great choice for the salts. Mix this well with a fork or a spoon. Next, add the essential or fragrance oils. We're using lavender essential oil here today. This is a very soothing fragrance, very popular in bath salts. Mix well between each drop added. Add as much or as little fragrance as you like till you get the strength you desire. Once you've added the fragrance, you're done. All you have to do is pour the salts into an airtight container and save them for your next bath. If you'd like to color the salts, you can use an FD&C liquid dye or mica powder. With dye, add one drop of color at a time and stir well until you get the desired shade. With mica powder, add no more than one-sixth to one-eighth a teaspoon and stir it very well. Be careful not to add more than an eighth of a teaspoon or you might color your skin while you're taking a bath. Dead sea salts are a great product to offer your customers. They're so good for your skin and you can choose any fragrance you'd like to scent them. It's so easy. I hope you try this idea today and enjoy it yourself.